The wingboard is wakeboarding for the sky. It allows you to hook onto the back of an airplane and carve through the clouds, carve through the sky, just like you do on a snowboard on a wakeboard on the ground, except now you're able to do it in three dimensions. The wingboard came from a childhood cartoon called Tailspin. Uh, it was something I used to watch every day after school. I always thought it was the coolest thing. One of the characters would hop out of the back of the airplane, throw a little wing onto his feet, grab onto a rope behind the airplane, just carve through the sky. The wingboard's currently in phase three of development. Uh, phase one was a small six scale model that proved out the aerodynamics and proved out the control methods. Phase two was a 40% model that had a human analog rider on it, human movement, human scale, size, and weight. Uh, that allowed us to prove how the human would react and also figure out all of our safety features. We're currently at the beginning of phase three, which is putting the first human rider on it, letting them get a feel for the board, what we need to tweak, uh, and what we're gonna need to do to train someone and transition to those first manned flights. So the reason that we came up to ACE is we needed to prove in a controlled environment that a human could actually ride this. We want somewhere that was safe, uh, that we didn't have to worry about the rider uh, falling off the board at low altitudes. So this gave us a chance in a very controlled environment to work up and let that rider get the feel uh, with the first flights before having to actually strap them to an aircraft. The best part about testing ACE has been the people. Uh, everyone has been so helpful and they've really made this possible uh, every step along the way. I mean, this is a developmental project. It, we don't know what's coming the next day and everyone has been so supportive in there every step of the way to help us and make this happen as easily as it did. Oh, it, this has been an unqualified success. I mean, we could not have hope for this to go any better than it did uh, over the last two days. We hit everything we ever hoped we could and actually got to the point yesterday that after the first couple of tests we sat there and we're like, well now what do we do? It's going so well that what else can we get out of the test today and how much more can we figure out and really got a lot further than we even thought we could.